it's Pelear today and I hope you guys liked the preview of this slow shutter effect. I really tried to make it as realistic as possible, this slow shutter effect, and I think I came pretty close to it at least. So yeah, I'm excited to show you guys how to make it in today's tutorial. And if you guys don't know, I have a website called editingvisuals.com where I have a bunch of editing packs that's going to help you out with your editing. So if you guys want to level up your editing game, be sure to check out the website. Now let's get into the tutorial. So here are my footage, I'm going to be showcasing the slow shutter effect on and I'm going to sort off by making a adjustment layer, so I'm going to press Ctrl Alt Y and here we're going to sort off by adding an effect called Pixel Motion Blur and yeah this effect is going to be very heavy so be, be ready for some, some lag I'm going to be increasing the shutter angle to 3000 so this is the difference here and we don't want these ghost things here. We want it to look more clean, a uh, more realistic look. And we have to drag up the shutter samples. And I'm going to drag that up to a 20. And of course you can drag it up even more. But as I said before, it's going to be a very, very heavy for your computer. So uh, I think this works fine. Uh, this, uh, yeah, uh, 20 shutter samples. So you guys see, you get this very, very cool motion blur effect here. Usually when you shoot uh, these, yeah, you know, slow shutter effects, it tends to be a little bit more laggy. So I'm going to drag down the FPS by using the post-rise time effect. I'm going to set it to 8. And this is how the effect is going to look. I think it looks absolutely amazing. I really, really love this, yeah, laggy motion blur slow shutter effect. And uh, yeah, I think it looks awesome. And if you guys want to save this as a preset now, you just have to select the effects here. Animation, save animation preset. Name it slow shutter effect. Press save and you have your slow shutter preset saved basically. Uh, and yeah, if you guys like this tutorial, don't forget to uh, like and subscribe and share this tutorial. Don't forget to check out my website, editingvisuals.com, where I have some pretty cool editing packs that's going to help you out with your editing. Also, don't forget to check out my socials, join my Discord server, and I'll see you guys soon. Take care and have a nice day.